What's going on, y'all? Wolf? Back at you again with another reaction. We're about to get into some more Naruto. Um, so yeah, we caught up. Naruto, Shikamaru, and Kiba caught up to fucking Tayuya and Sakon, right? And it was looking like a dub. We got the fucking Sasuke barrel, but a new enemy has arrived. And he goes by the name of Kimimaro, who we learned a few things about him. Um, he has a Keke Genkai, which is a blood trait move that we haven't seen yet. Similar to the Sharingan and Byakugan and Haku's thing, so I'm excited to see what his bloodline jutsu is, you know what I'm saying? Um, he is one of Orochimaru's top minions. Apparently the Sound 4 used to, used to be called the Sound 5 with him at the, time, him at the top. And uh, he was also going to be Orochimaru's main vessel, and actually Orochimaru preferred Kimimaro over Sasuke. So that should also say how just how strong Kimimaro is, and how special, you know, his his Keke Genkai. It's hard saying that word. Keke Genkai. Keke Genkai. Sometimes, you know or not. Um, and lastly, he's on the brink of death. <laughs> he is a. Uh, he was literally on the hospital bed or medical bed fucking attached to so many IVs and medicine and wires and shit just to keep him alive and he was like you know fuck it I'm about to die soon I'm gonna do my my last mission will be to retrieve the Sasuke you know Orochimaru's vessel back to him right and, and when, he, when he left that hospital bed apparently he was able to catch up to Tayuya's group takes the Sasuke barrel from Shikamaru and Naruto at the same time, and um, and well, it looks like he's about to uh, fight Naruto, and Naruto is already in demon chakra form. You know what I'm saying? His eyes are red. He's got the whiskers. He's got the teeth. Rawr, you know. And what's crazy is Naruto cat uh, Naruto obviously casted his you know multi shadow clone jutsu right, and he summoned like a fucking bajillion of these things, but Kimimaro was like. Hmm. Okay, like he he looks calm. He looks calm. That's what's scary. How strong is this guy, bro? <sighs> I'm just imagining if he's this calm and like strong at the brink of death. Imagine him at like a hundred percent. What the fuck? What kind of guy are we dealing with right now? You know what I'm saying? Shit. So yeah, that's going on. And obviously Kiba and Sakoin fell into a fucking, I guess a cliff hole. <laughs> A random cliff hole in the forest so they're gonna have their 1v1 which is a very you know um it's a it's a proper fight because it's technically a 2v2 we know we know kiba's got akamaru his little doji and uh sakon has his fucking double head in the back that we still have no idea what it does right we don't know if it's an actual human or if it's like you know fucking kankuro's uh um little uh, what does he call it i forgot what he calls it I forgot what he calls it, but he, he has a little puppet with hair on his back. That's what it reminds me of, so uh, similar to that. And of course, we have Shikamaru against Tayuya. So we have our 1v1s all set. Um, Sasuke's still chilling chillin inside the barrel. You know, he can come out at any moment, any moment he wishes, or at least when he's done with the ritual. So we got to finish his 1v1s. We have to have Naruto open the barrel, talk to Sasuke, talk no jutsu his ass, and tell him, hey, baby, come back. And that's pretty much it. So, let's go ahead and get him motherfucking going, man. Um, but of course, before we do that, make sure you guys hit that like button, hit that subscribe button. I cool. Naruto episodes 120 to 121. Oh yeah, I forgot this bitch summons fucking Mortal Kombat characters. <laughs> oh, what the hell? He's a Siamese twin? Is that a Siamese twin? Fuck, it is! <gasps> Whoa. Damn. He does have a sign used to it. <laughs> okay, interesting design. I dig it. Oh, 
だが所詮ゴミはゴミでしかない掃除するまでの Damn, this Kimimaro guy is all about the business. What is that? Is that his bone? That just came out from his palm, no? Oh, damn. So the flute controls them? Like the Poke Flute to Snorlax? Ah,、uh, that's a curse mark activation. That's kind of cool. She's like a snake charmer. Except she charms big ass fucking undead dudes. Oh, so the other thing is actually his brother? Ukon? Oh my god, that's fucking. Oh. That's a cool power and all, but it's kind of disgusting to look at. Like, it, like, it, like an arm comes out of his eye and shit? Like, what? It's disturbing. And he's got a different voice. <laughs> of course he does. Oh shit. Yeah, Ukon doesn't waste fucking time, bro. Holy shit. Bro, is he like Wolverine or some shit? But that's his fucking bone sticking out of his palm, man. If I'm looking at that correctly. That's Wolverine before he got the adamantine in his body. Spoilers. Ew. Wait, we're, that's actually part of the training? Are we gonna pee on him? Oh! That's dope. Holy shit. This attack, he becomes Akamaru instead of Akamaru becoming him. That's dope. I like that. So, why the P? Oh! That shit's definitely gonna fucking hurt. Nice. Nice. Oh, did I rip him apart? Oh, shit, it did. GG? G fucking G. Uh, what? No. Oh, oh, what? That's kind of cool, no cap. Well, now there are two dudes. <laughs> Shit. Okay. Do you have another attack, Kiba? <laughs> Shit! <laughs> yeah, that wall looks like those, um. Those fucking. Those things on Mario, the fucking. You know, the spiky things that fall on the floor. Oh no, Akamaru! Huh? Fuck. He can do that? He can actually do that? Shit. That's OP. Jesus, he's in our body? Pause! What the fuck? How do you beat someone like that? How do you even hit him? You have to hit yourself. <laughs> 
蔵の各機関に深く絡み合ってるのは知ってるな簡単に言えば体を粉々にして敵の体内に入り込みまた元に戻して外に出ることができる That's crazy Fuck that power I would not want to go against him What the hell dude There's no way I'm fighting a guy with limbs sticking out of my body Jeez. What the hell? This guy is. His power is crazy. If he gets a hold of you, you're fucked. What the fuck? This is bad. Oh! I mean. I guess. <laughs> God damn it, dude. Why are e every single one of these 1v1s is so stressful, man? <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> God. Can't one of them just be a fucking stomp? You know what I mean? Each and every single one. Choji's stressful. Neji's stressful. Both dead. Looks like Kiba's about to die too for the W. Golly, bro. <sighs> this arc is it's playing with my emotions. He's really gonna. Where? Okay, he split. Shit. But we still stabbed ourselves. Fuck. Okay, well, there's no way Kiba left Akamara on his own like that, so he's probably baiting him or some shit. Oh! 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 Nice! Holy shit! Good attack! <laughs> that would have got me. I would have got fucking stabbed. Fucking Akamaro balloon bomb of kunai. <laughs> that doesn't look good. That looks like he's bleeding out. <laughs> See? They're doing it again. The butterflies, the fucking flowers, the scenery. The flashbacks, the sunlight. God damn it, bro. <sighs> That's so dope how there's a clan that fucking uses a dog as their companion to fight. That's actually dope as fuck. <laughs> Very cool. What are they called? The Inazuka clan, right? Kiba Inazuka? Her dog looks like a fucking badass. Shit. Oh, it's also missing an ear, so that means it's been through battles and shit. I have a random thought. Um, Akamara's voice actor made easy money. <laughs> Just going into the booth. <laughs> That's easy money for a voice actor right there, voicing as a fucking dog. Holy shit. That's hilarious. <laughs> Oh, it looks like Ukon has a cooldown. He gotta sleep. Okay, that's good. That's a little bit of balance in his power. Damn. This Kimimaro guy is nasty, bro. Ooh. 
Footwork. Yeah, hit. I like his fighting style. His movements are minimal. You know? He, it's like barely any wasted energy. But at the same time, he can't really waste energy because he doesn't, he doesn't really have any, right? He's just pure willpower right now. <clears throat> oh, shit. What the fuck? It can come out of his elbow, too? Whoa. Yeah, it's coming out of his body. This is his Keke Genkai? Yeah. Damn, he's Wolverine. V2. It's just a better Wolverine, honestly. That it's definitely unsettling to watch, but it's a cool power nonetheless. Ugh, Jesus. It's making me cringe watching it. Oh shit, is Sasuke coming? He's coming out? Fuck. He actually made a bone sword. <laughs> I thought I've only seen a bone sword in Elder Scrolls. What is this? Mm, so dances are his attacks? That's dope. That's dope how his fighting style is kind of a dance. I could definitely dig that. I could definitely dig that. Clone! Substitution! <clears throat> what, someone's coming? Oh, fuck, more enemies? Who's coming? Fuck me, dude. <sighs> Kiba's over here bleeding out. Fucking Nakamaru got punched. Gosh. Ugh. Ah. It's actually kind of hurting my ears, low key, bro. What the fuck? That pitch. That pitch is fucking me up. No cap. Well. Alright. Well. Kimimaro is nasty. His Keke Genkai. So what? He's just able to manipulate his bones and can create weapons with it and shit and make it hard to steal? Okay. Yeah, it's a pretty good power. So he has, a, he has basically an, lim an unlimited supply of weapons. Also, I'm gonna go ahead and guess he can use his defense too. If it's as hard as steel, it's a pretty good defense, right? Um, and he seems to be a pretty damn good fighter. His, his movements look fluid as hell, and apparently the way he fights is he, he uses dances. It's like having uh, you know forms in, in Taekwondo or Karate, you know what I'm saying? He uses dances, and I definitely can dig that, because fighting is low-key kind of dancing in a way, you know what I'm saying? Um, so yeah, I definitely can't wait to see him and Naruto go at it more. Um, Kiba? Kiba? <sighs> see, they're, they're doing what they did to Choujo and Neji to Kiba. Well, not as bad, because it looks like Kiba's still, you know, kicking and still alive and protecting, uh, protecting Akamara and shit. But he's bleeding out, he fucking had to stab himself to remove that Ukon guy from his fucking back. And yeah, we don't know what's happening to him. But he also says, says Kiba smelled people coming so there's more fucking enemies coming come on man like what the fuck if there are more enemies coming we better have more reinforcements coming for real you know what i'm saying gosh and i wouldn't put it past orchimaru to send more too because i mean it is taking a while for him to first you know sasuke's retrieval and whatnot so it could be like kabuto and fucking two other grunts coming and kabuto is pretty nasty Pretty nasty, definitely Jonin level at least. 
You know what I'm saying? He was able to hold his own in the whole signing fight between Tsunade, Orochimaru, and Jiraiya. You know, so he's definitely legit. So if he's coming, fuck, we're definitely gonna need some fucking help, bro. But there's no one else at the village. Everyone's on a fucking mission. Rock Lee's injured. Tsunade has to do the Hokage thing. Know what I'm saying? Hmm. Well, okay. Whoever it is, can they like wait to attack before we're done with our fights or some shit? <laughs> Come on, man. This is too much. This arc is definitely... It's stressful, dude. It's so stressful. I feel like every fight is like 50-50. You know what I mean? It can go either way. You know what I mean? And I know as, as the good guys, we have the better chance of winning just because of anime, you know, plot armor and shit, but fuck, dude. It's so stressful. And by the looks of it, Neji is like on his way out the door, just like Choji. I mean, sorry, Kiba is on his way out the door, just like Choji and Neji were when they were finished with their fights. <sighs> fuck. Well, the problem is this, uh, this Sakon guy is still alive. His brother is sleeping though, that's good, so it looks like his brother has a cooldown, a sleeping cooldown, which is, you know, it's, it's a good balance for his power, because his brother's power is fucking insane. He can go inside anyone's body and kind of like control them and shit, that's, that's crazy. That's definitely crazy for assassination, assassination as, as he was saying when he was explaining his power, you know? But he's sleeping, but Sakon is still alive and he's still in, you know, monster form, so he's still pretty goddamn powerful. And we haven't defeated him yet, so maybe Kiba's, you know, just trying to think of a plan to finally get him. Um, you know, before, I guess, catching up to Shikamaru and Naruto, if he doesn't die, that is. And yeah, Shikamaru has to figure out how to win against this, this flute girl. I mean, he can't get close to her. She's, of course, she's controlling three huge-ass fucking undead dudes that keep swinging at, her, at Shikamaru. You know what I'm saying? So that's, that fight's fucking hard. And of course, we got Naruto fighting against Kimimaru, the strongest one out of the Sound Five. Right? And Orochimaru's original vessel with a fucking bone kekegen kai that looks pretty damn cool. It's like cringy to look at when he does it, but it's a pretty damn cool power, no cap. You know what I'm saying? Um, so yeah. Very cool. A lot of good fights happening. Uh, it's very stressful to watch, which is good. You know, it's, you know, it's uh, as a viewer, it, sure it is stressful, but that means what I'm watching is, is good. You know what I'm saying? I'm enjoying what I'm watching, so that's good. And uh, yeah, man. Um, Sasuke looks like he is progressing in his ritual. It was, it, the barrel was steaming, and Kimimaro said it's close to being done, so... I don't know, either Sasuke... One or two things can happen when, when Sasuke comes out of that barrel. He'll be a good guy, or he'll be a bad guy. And most likely he'll be a bad guy. And Sorry, I'm kind of looking Naruto, in that case, has to talk no to him after beating Kimimaro. So Naruto's got a fucking... <laughs> He's got such a big job on his plane, man. Holy shit. Um, so if Naruto... I mean, god damn it. I feel like Naruto didn't get enough recognition for um, beating Gara. I feel like he got, like, no recognition for beating Gara. Does anyone even know he beat Gara? Holy shit. No, I feel like everyone still treats him like a fucking simple-ass Genin. But, dude, he was one of the MVPs in the when the Orochimaru attacked the village, man. Goddamn. So if he succeeds in this mission of bringing Sasuke back, they better give my man Naruto some goddamn respect. I feel like they had they, they don't. Nothing. Ah. Alright, bro. I'm looking forward to the fights. And, uh, well, I can't wait to see what happens. I want to see Marki Mimaro. I want to see his dances. His, I like I like the way he, he fights. It's fluid. It's, you know, it's very... It's like water. You know what I'm saying? Bruce Lee. Alright, bro. Uh, if you guys enjoyed those Naruto episodes just as much as I did, make sure you hit that like button, hit that subscribe button. Alright, cool.